Ilex verticillata, winterberry. These are shrubs reaching six to eight feet high at maturity, usually with an upright or somewhat rounded habit. The foliage is deciduous and the leaves are alternately arranged. The leaf shape is elliptic to obovate, one and a half to three inches long, although up to four inches long, and a half inch to one inch, although up to two inches wide. Leaf margins are serrate, the undersides may be slightly pubescent, and the fall color is yellow. Pubescence on the vein undersides may occur. Ornamental features of Ilex verticillata include the dark gray-brown bark that turns fairly dark or black with age. The fruit are berry-like rounded droops that occur in clusters of two to seven. Individual droops may be a quarter inch to a half inch across. The berry-like droops begin green and will turn red as they ripen. This will occur in August and through September and often the berries persist through January. Cultural information for Ilex verticillata. These are hardy from zones three to nine. They do best in full sun, but will tolerate part shade. The berry set is best under full sun conditions. They prefer an acidic to neutral soil pH five to 7.4. They are native in Iowa, central and eastern USA and into Canada. Note, this requires both male and female plants to be present for fruit set, usually of a ratio of one male to every eight or so female plants. These do well in heavy soils, but they tend to prefer acidic soils, anywhere from about four five to six five, and may develop chlorosis or yellowing of the leaves at pHs higher than that. An excellent use for these is anytime you can mass them or use them as a shrub border Put them alongside the water or in wet soils. And remember, don't forget the males or you won't get fruit on the females.